Good morning, Midlow. I'm Tanaj Williams. And I'm Maddox Johnson. Today is Monday, March 27th, 2023. We will have a regular bell schedule all week except for today, which is half day. In this week's broadcast, we will learn a bit more about Midlow's girls lacrosse team, and as always, catch you up on all things Midlow. But first, how does the weather look this week, Patterson? Thanks, Tanaj and Maddox. Good morning, Midlow. For everyone with pollen allergies, it's your lucky week. This week will be a little bit cloudy and rainy. Temperatures will be fairly warm, reaching into the 60s, which starts our 2023 spring season strong. This rainy weather is perfect for enjoying a great book, catching up on homework, or splashing in puddles. I'm Patterson Summers, and thank you for joining me for this week's weather forecast. Now, it's time for sports. Take it away, Aaron. Thanks, Patterson. Congratulations to our Medford team as they finished 4-4-2 on the season, having one of the best seasons they've ever had. Congratulations to all the spring sports teams as they had a Monacan sweep last week after boys soccer won in double overtime 1-0. Varsity softball and baseball kick off the week tonight at home playing Prince George at 5 o'clock. They will then travel to Clover Hill tomorrow and be back at home on Thursday to roll through the Titans of Cosby. JV softball and baseball will visit Prince George tonight. They will be at home on Tuesday versus Clover Hill, and they will travel over to Cosby on Thursday. Boys soccer will be on the road at Clover Hill tomorrow, and then will be at home as they look to upset Cosby on Thursday. On Tuesday, girls soccer will host Clover Hill, JV at 5.30, and varsity at 7 o'clock. On Thursday, they will look to defeat the Titans at Cosby. Boys tennis will be at home against Cosby at 3.30, and on Thursday, we'll head to the swamp of James River. Girls tennis will take a trip to Cosby on Tuesday, and on Thursday, take on the Rapids at home. Wednesday, boys lacrosse will look to beat the Cavaliers at Clover Hill. I had the chance to talk to the captains of our girls lacrosse team, and here is what they had to say. What's up, Midlow? I'm here with Grace Lucero, Regan Underwood, and Scarlett South, who are the captains of your girls lacrosse team. I have some questions to get to know them as well as the team. So being early in the season, starting off one and two, what has been the message for the team? Um, I think our biggest focus right now is just to play together as a team and stay competitive. What helps motivate the team? I think the support from our new coaches and music before and after games or practices just lifts us all up. And what are the goals for the rest of the season? I definitely say our main goal for the season is to make it to playoffs and to get pretty far, but just staying competitive and working together as a team. So thank you guys so much, and good luck with the rest of your season. Thank, thank you. you. They will play at home on Wednesday against Clover Hill, JV at 5.30 and Varsity at 7 o'clock. Make sure to get tickets at GoFan.co. For the Love of Sports, I'm Aaron Figgy. Thank you for those updates, Patterson and Aaron, and now today's announcements. In honor of our last Monday during Women's History Month, we share a quote from the famous Ruth Bader Ginsburg. My mother told me to be a lady, and for her, that meant to be your own person, be independent. Remember to donate to the pads and tampons drive to earn pep rally points. The National Honor Society is currently accepting applications from juniors. Juniors, in order to apply, you must have a 3.6 GPA, have good character, perform community service, and, and participate in extracurricular activities. Please see Mrs. Costello in room 144 with any questions. Judaism Club will have a meeting after school on Monday, March 27th in the orchestra room. We will be learning the history of Passover along with other fun activities. Everyone is invited and we hope to see you there. Richmond's very own poet laureate, Roscoe Burnham's, will be at Midlothian High School during MAP Zero this Wednesday in the auditorium. All IB students and all seniors are encouraged to attend. Do you have some gently used books at home? Consider donating them to the used book donation going on now. Books will be sold in April and all proceeds will benefit Pride Liberation. Drop your donations off in front of Mr. Jones's office in the library. Not only do we need your gently used books, but you may also donate gently used shirts, pants, and accessories. Proce proceeds from these items will benefit United for Iran. Again, these donations can also be dropped off in front of Mr. Jones's office in the library. If you have questions, see student leader Cam Penn. Attention all Rho Kappa Honor Society members. Be sure to visit the link you see on the screen to order and pay for all your membership cords by March 31st. Class officer, class officer elections are right around the corner. Visit the link you see here to access all the details in the application process and to complete the application. All applications are due by April 11th. If you have any questions, please contact your rising class sponsor. Attention the 2023 student faculty kickball classic will be on Thursday, April 20th. 
and we're looking for kickballers. Each class will field a team of 15 players to include three faculty members. If you're interested in playing for your class team, go to bit.ly slash 2023kickball. Please note that there will be a random lottery to select lineups. So signing up does not guarantee that you'll be on the team. Signups will close on March 31st. If you have any questions, see Mr. Johnson in room 314. Had a late book? Get off the hook. This is the last week to submit a limerick to waive all library fines. Seniors, all books need to be returned and fines paid before picking up graduation tickets. Jazz Bruner took advantage of this offer with this limerick. When I learned I had fines, I was sad. I didn't realize they were bad. But now they are paid. On this I've laid. On the counter that they were first made. See any librarians with questions. Thank you, Midlow, for joining us today, March 27th. I'm Tanaj Williams. And I'm Maddox Johnson. Make it a great day. Or not. The choice is yours. Go Midlow. Thank you to Grayson Flournoy, our camera operator and editor who worked on this week's announcements.